I'm no deed, it's just my channel that is six feet under. So I uh, welcome back to Son of Scotland 90, a channel that has been sitting here collecting dust for months, been neglected. Just like um, just like all the kids were neglected at Celtic Park during those horrible times, my channel has been neglected. But no one, the big jock knew and he didn't say anything, well, I know about my channel being neglected and I'm going to stand up and I'm going to do something about it and that is why I am back, guys. Yes, I haven't uploaded in about four months, four months too long. Four months is a fucking joke, let's be perfectly honest. Like, it is, we should be discussed it. That's Gaming Jesus in the background. Uh, Biggest draw on YouTube, you can remember that. Yeah, well, I mean, he's increasing the record record high numbers, I guess, and uh, aye, the best Rangers YouTuber out there, so... It's very unlikely you're subscribed to me and not subscribed to him, but if you're not, then get on it, Gaming Jesus, Don't and there's there's lots of good content and shit on that, but I mean, by far be but better than CJ Novo, better than Ryan 118, better than that guy that I don't actually mind, but he's better than all those fuckers, right, so just go and subscribe to him. But anyway, we're back then with a new Hearts Cream mode. I said I was going to do it, and I am a man of my word, I deliver my promises, even if I have to deliver them about 10 years out of date. We are going to do a new Hearts Cream World, and we are going to finish this one, guys. So, um, I decided that since it's been such a long time between the last time I uploaded anything, all the series that I was doing, unfortunately, I was going to end them there. I'm not only, I just don't think you can pick up something that you've just, you know, not did for like four or five months. So, I think the best thing to do is to just, you know, start fresh, restart, and uh, we'll have new players, we'll have the updated squads and stuff like that. So, it kind of. You know, that'll, that'll kind of work to my advantage in a way. Plus the fact that hearts are pissed in real life. There's zero expectation on me. And I could finish last and it would be okay. Because if I'm shite with hearts in real life. If I'm shite with hearts in FIFA, it doesn't matter. Because we're shite in real life as well. So we'll, we'll click on Big Virgil Van Dijk. The £75 million pound rated defender. I wish we'd a team rated at that, but um, who knows, 7.5 maybe, if we're being kind. We'll download the latest squads, and uh, I as for FIFA, I might just stick to the one career mode, guys. I might just do a hearts career mode. I'm sick of doing about 15 different career modes and never getting to finish any of them, so the way I see it, if I do one, I should be able to get pretty far into it, albeit we are in February. I mean, more than half the football season is already gone. And, you know, the way FIFA and PES come out uh, in, like, September, October, you've lost most of the most of the seasons over. So I am kind of playing these games when they're out of date, but I feel like playing an out of date game is better than just not playing at all. So that is why we're going ahead, and that is why we're doing this. And um, first we need to pick the manager name. And uh, hi, Steve, any, any thoughts to add on this uh, comeback? Or? It's going to be great, better than ever before. It is. It is. Fucking gonna bullshitting you. It is going to be. Took me about fucking half an hour to figure out how to set up the capture card. Well, that was a bit of an issue. Yeah, but it was me that set it up. I mean, I think I'd have been shafted to see if I was on my own. Oh, I've spelt my name where I might a small C. Does anybody give a shit? I give a shit because I've got OCD and that would piss me the fuck off. So I'm going to have to go back, guys, and restart my name. Jesus Christ. Roger, man, yeah. So like I said, I'm only planning on... I, I'm open to doing a second career mode. Or maybe an ultimate team. Maybe we'll uh, actually do uh, Edinburgh United. We could do it. I think it had a lot of promise. And just like I say, just never really got started on it. So it's definitely something that we will consider. But for now, I just want to get stuck into this Hearts Cream mode. I want to get a few episodes under my belt. A few games under my belt. And then we'll take things from there. We're also going to do a Master League in Pez. But um, I'm not going to be going Hearts. I just want to go a different team. Mix things up a wee bit. Anyway, here you can see is the transfer budgets and um, Rangers actually the same rate as Celtic. I'm not sure if that's news or not, or if, the, if it's always been that way. I don't know. It could be the uh, new it squad updates. Uh, Motherwell, two and a half star. Kilmarnock, two and a half star. Hearts and Hibs, both two and a half star. Well, let's be real. Aberdeen, two and a half star. Did not really have a 1.3 1, 1. transfer budget? Uh, 13 on a pound, maybe. If but but I, I'm, doubt, I'm doubting the, the, the realism of that 1.3. Uh, so anyway, there we go, Hearts. Domestic success high, continental success very low. I don't think we'll be qualifying for Europe anytime soon, so don't need to worry about that. Brand exposure, financial, and youth Well, they're both medium, and youth development is high. Well, I mean, we, we normally do have a good youth system, my Hearts, so 
We don't need to worry about that too much. Also, if you want to see a football manager series, I've, I've yet to play it, guys. Haven't even bought it yet. But if you want to see it, I'll beg Gaming Jesus to buy me it. And uh, <laughs> as pathetic as that sounds, and uh, we it's could. It's the truth, damn it. <laughs> it's the fucking truth. Because I don't buy games anymore. But, um. Look, I, 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 I had my decade of buying games, right? Now it's, now it's my turn to sit back and. Reap the, the, the glory, the benefits. Well, that's pretty, like, it's not like the, the back end of the 2010s, you bought all the games I love, is it? Like? No. <laughs> the back end of the fucking millennial years. The millennium, damn it. Right, so there we go, we've entered the uh, stadium, Tyne Castle, that's what we like to see. Apply and exit, all that good stuff. Uh, transfer window. I'm going to disable it just for the first window, because like I said, it's pretty much a new game to me, so I don't really need to have uh, that on. Half length, we're going six minutes. Match difficulty, it will be ultimate. That means I'll probably get my ass handed to me, but, you know, I'll settle for it, man. If we get beat, we get beat. I'm not going to cry about it. I'm not going to cry over spilled milk. We'll, we'll just, we'll get on with it. And then you can see the uh, Europa League groups, and they're the same groups as real life, so it's all good to see real as Well, apart from St. Johnston, I don't know what the fuck they're doing in there. We'll get them changed. Uh, we'll put in Aberdeen, since they were the closest team Apart from the old firm to qualify. I would have put in Kelly since they finished third, but uh, after losing to the, the... Who was it they lost to? The Connors Queen Nomads. Ah, the job squad. Yeah, yeah, if you lose to them, you fucking... You don't deserve it to be anywhere near, near Europe. So, Aberdeen will be going into the Group L and they'll be alongside AC Alkma, Man United and Mulder. I could have put ourselves in, but let's be honest, we don't deserve it. I'd rather earn it. You know what I mean? I'd rather have a good first season. And I think... The aim this season is going to be trying to finish third. I know I've just talked about finishing last there, but come on. It's about time we had a good season in FIFA. I'm sick of finishing last. Fuck's sake. A bit of optimism. I mean, and maybe not even optimism, but miracles can happen from uh, time to time. Hopefully this will be one of those occasions. So here we go. Unknown manager at a point. What do you mean unknown manager? I play this shit every single year, mate, and I go hearts. How am I fucking unknown? Because you're pish and you've won hee-haw. Even then, I should be known for being pish. Well, that's very true. Unknown manager, man. It's the same guy every fucking year. Hearts career mode, Hearts Master League, and I get absolutely pumped. Maybe it's because I don't complete a season. Maybe it's because I always upload a couple of episodes and I quit. They're like, ah, who the fuck's this jobber? But who knows? Inter there have signed Diego Gordon. I mean, they really need to change it up. So, yeah, you can see the series that I was last doing. Last time I was on, look at that, the 10th of October. Jesus Christ. That is the last time we, we played it. Fucking hell. I haven't shit. played this in a decade. Ah, pretty much. <laughs> that is men that is mental. Right, you know what? Uh, nah, I'm not gonna say I was gonna save over that, but you know what? It's a new it's a new day, guys. Yes it is. It's a new generation. So we're gonna go and uh how do you just get so anyway to clear I clear. Uh so we're just gonna go ahead, put the new team in. Oh I don't know if it's my controller or if this is just very sensitive, but you're you're trying to switch between the the letters and it's fucking up big time. Look at that. Shocking. You go, Hearts FC. There you go. That's us in. We're here. We're ready. Isn't so you looking to buy a PS2 and the, the cheapest is 215 quid? What I am going to do, guys, I think I'm going to enter the pre-season tournament. Yes. Because cause I haven't played this. I'm not even joking, guys. I haven't played this game in about... Well, last you've seen it there. Last time I fucking played it was October the tenth. I'm not even bullshitting you. So I never enter these because personally, I like to get stuck into the season and waste no time. But I'm a real, I'm realistic. If I get stuck into the season, I'll get smashed first game after Ross County about ten 0 So we're going to advance to the in fights, and we're going to see here. I'm not even doing it for the money. I'm just doing it for the. Uh, it's all about the money, but we're not doing it for the money. We're we're doing it to the money. We're, we're doing it to try and get a bit of fucking um, a bit of momentum built here at the club. So I'm looking at all these competitions and all the teams seem shite, which kind of suits us down to the ground. We'll fit right in. But I'm I'm trying to look at a group. I'm trying to look at all these competitions where we come up against a team. We'd be like, oh, you know, I can't wait to play them. But you know what? We'll, we'll go with we'll go with the the German one. Why not? Battle of the Nazis, and we'll see what happens there. But very lackluster, guys. I was expecting to come up, be coming up against Man United and stuff, Liverpool, but... Oh, we've got Osnabrück! Ho-ho! <laughs> Sounds familiar! I know a guy that was fucking born there. Um, 
So, first we'll get stuck into the notifications. Hearts board, they want us to... What the fuck? They don't even, they don't even have any expectations. They're just happy that we've showed up. Field a team. Our vision and board, our scout reports, introduce myself. I mean, it's the same generic shite. Once you've read that, you've, you've read it a million times. Read it once, you've read it a million times. Objectives for this season in uh, Scottish Cup reach the semi-final. I, I do believe this game's flawed. It's, I mean, if you're lucky, you start in the quarters already. And well, worst case scenario, you, you start in the last 16, you know what I mean? But I don't think the cup competitions really work in these games that only have one league. Yeah. I, I don't know. I, I really don't know a way around it. I guess if they don't have more teams, you can't really add teams that are not from that country or that league or whatever. But I don't know. It would be nice, I think, if FIFA would add at least the second division for each, you know, country. But then again, I mean, you've got the Irish league. Who wants? Who wants? This? I don't know if I don't have a second division league. But I mean, who wants to see it if they do? Definitely not me. Um, brand exposure, we know all about that. Domestic success, achieve a high finish. A, a high finish, I'm going to assume, is probably top four, maybe top half. Who knows? Who bloody knows? At this rate, it, it could be anything. Just uh, we're going to try and not get sacked by the end of the season, and that will do us fine. So, one, of the, I was going to start a uh, Hearts Master League, but I was pissed off they never had Liam Boyce. But they have Liam Boyce in FIFA, and that's what it's all about. The former Ross County man. Doesn't get much better than that, does it? Like that 68 overall. 73 penalty, 73 shot power. Finesse shot, 73 aggression, 81 strength, 74 jumping. He might be slow as fuck, but... Why have Horse got so many strikers, like? I don't know. Because see, that Washington CJ Novo. It does look a bit like CJ Novo, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. wonder if Washington's a boring bastard as well. Um, there we go, it's Stephen A. Smith, the main man. This, if we're going to have a good season, it's going to be down to this guy, no doubt about it. We've got uh, Coronavirus himself, Machino, out oh. on the left. Uh, <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding, I'm big man, you're, you're the man. You're only in Chinese. You don't even eat dogs, no, I know. I, I like the Japanese, Japanese have never done anything bad to me. Henderson. Pearl Harbor was pretty shit on them, like. I actually, I fucked that. Fuck the Japs, damn it. Um... Clear right back. I mean, the guy's what a striker, but he's a centre mid in the game, and he's, but he's playing it right back. I mean, I just don't even understand this. We've got Halkett and Suter. That'll probably be my centre back partnership. Oh my god! I just realised we didn't have Christoph Berra. The guy's been fucking loaned out. To Dundee. Why get him back at the end of the season? Or no, Dundee aren't in the game, so you'll be getting he haw. So Christoph Berra has effectively retired. Ah oh, well, yeah, he's just gone. He's in my fucking thumbnail. Is he? That's awkward. Ah, well. It's... Breaking news, guys. Transfer windows no even opened, but Christoph Berra has retired. They said, I came to the Jam Tarts to be successful, to win trophies. Instead, we've won fuck all. I'm leaving, mate. I'm going back down south. I'm I'm going to be a Diddy player in Wolves or whatever, whoever he used to play for. So there you go, breaking news. It is official. Christoph Berra has left the club with immediate effect, and uh, I'm a wee bit gutted. I'll tell you that right now. But uh, Michael Smith is a player that's definitely not leaving the club. He should be... I don't know why he's not on the team. And he's going straight in there at right back. As for left back, we'll probably play Garuccio there. Unless I can see anyone better than a guy. So, Well, I mean, we've got Hickey. I would like to play Hickey because he's only, he's only two ratings less than Garuccio. And he's 17. So if we play him, he'll improve just dramatically. I think we're going to play him. I think it has to be done. I'm sorry, well, Gru obviously. I'm sorry, I mean, I like you, Gru like 81 pace, mate. Hold on, let's compare the stats here. Apparently, Hickey's a better defender. Well, there you go. Yeah, I'm going to have to play Hickey, I'm sorry. I like I like to go with the youth anyway. Celtic like, like the youth as well, but I prefer them a little bit older than they do. Um, we've got this new guy that I'm not even going to try and pronounce his name, because I know I'll botch it. Oh, Fidji. A Fidji, there you go. He's a, he's, do, you think, do you not think that name sounds like someone who, who streams on Twitch, but they're really shit, right. but they've got a massive following? Like Son of Skull and 90. That guy's not got a massive following. Uh, yeah, you're goddamn <laughs> guy's not even got a single fuel. Um, a Fidji, uh, should we put him in instead of Machino? All right, well, we'll get we'll get some Corona fighters on the bench, go for it. Um, as for the rest of the team here, we've got Jamie Walker. This guy has to be, maybe not starting, like, but I mean, it's weird. See, when I thought Jamie Walker was coming back, I was getting excited. I was thinking he was going to be the star man, but he's not really done a lot. I've got to be honest, he's done, done absolutely hee-haw. 
CG and Ovo's going to get dropped to the bench. Uh, Harry Cochrane, who I do like, just hasn't really impressed much in recent times. Uh, you got the new guy, Sibic, who is <laughs> right back in the game. But he's playing at... He's not going to be starting over Smith, though. No danger. Uh, we'll play... Can we play Jimmy Walker? Can we get Jimmy Walker in there? I think we can. I think Jimmy Walker can play there. I think he can. Why not? Maybe just Civic 20. Oh, I'm, I'm kind of tempted here to... We could go five at the back. I don't know. I'm tempted to play... But nah, we like Mike, Michael Smith's the Rolls Royce of this team. Michael Smith's staying. Michael Smith's here to stay. Michael Smith's here till we win trophies. So basically he's here for life because we ain't winning nothing. Um, Slamal. Well, Pierre, Pierre is 68 rated in this game. I wouldn't even give him a 6.8 rating. Based on how he does in real life. Like that's shocking. Irvine. Another young player who I just don't think should be there. Can we get Bosnich in? Or what about Demore? Should we get Demore in? Uh, well, I forgot about Haring. I've got Haring there. Let me get him in. Um, is that us then? I'm, I'm looking. I'm looking. I'm looking. Cochrane's on the bench. We, do, we have got a decent team. I'm not going to lie. Team's decent. It looks no bad. Machino. I don't know who else can we get in there. Bosnich. Uh, Claire. She, Claire. Claire should be able to get a spot on the bench, shouldn't he? Like, that's hectic that he can't get a place in the... Henderson, what's he doing there? You know, we'll put Claire out in the right. We could put Walker out in the right, maybe. Yeah, we'll do that. And Henderson gets dropped to the bench. So I think that's going to be our team, guys, going forward. Uh, Piera, Hickey, Suter, Halkett, Smith, Walker, Haring, Afiji, Naismith, Claire, and Boyce. I don't know. I mean, I'm going to go with Boyce for now. If he doesn't do well, we'll just replace him with the big man. Uchi Ikepesu, but for now, I think it's got to be Liam Boyce. I need to make sure we save that after 15 minutes of torture me picking the team. What a disaster it would have been had we backed out and not got that saved. Um, there's some promising players here, but again, like I said, transfer windows closed, so we ain't going to be signing anybody. 23k for the wage budget. That's, that's decent. Blessings um, in my bank. Definitely mail that's in my bank. And uh, here we go. We've just received a message from Stevie Naismith, the man. Crucial player. Greetings, boss. On behalf of the whole team, I'd like to give you a warm welcome at heart. So I appreciate that, Stephen. I'm excited about the future. I really believe that we can achieve great things together this season as long you as you get your shit. You are the guy, mate. You're the only guy we need. Is he, the, is he the only crucial player at the club? He might be. He might be. No, he's no. <laughs> There's five of them. Haring, Smith, Naismith, Halkett and Suter. That makes sense, I guess. That makes sense. Halkett's only... I thought Halkett was older than 24. I'm See, actually... I thought that I signed him in my career. Wasn't it? I'm like season 5 and he's only 28, so... That's fucking great. I thought he was an old bastard. Well, not old, like, but... I thought he was, thought he was at least older than me. But now I'm happy to find out he's only 24. And so, there you go. So happy days. Quite a lot of youth in this team. This team can go far. Part face, Stephen A. Smith's legs. There's not much youth in that. But anyway, guys, that is it then. Uh, next time out, we'll be playing Regensburg in this European Continental Shield. Like I said, I'm not too bothered what the results are. I'm not bothered about winning this. I don't really care. The main thing is, I just want to try and get back to the familiar with the controls of FIFA. And if we can pick up a win or two, it'd be absolutely fantastic. But if not, it will prepare us for the start of the season. And we'll have a quick look here at the fixture list. I do believe we take on... Ha Ab oh, it's Aberdeen opening game. So we get Aberdeen, Ross County, uh, Celtic in the first three games. So pretty tough start. But hopefully we can um, do better than we did against Aberdeen on the opening day. And uh, aye guys, that'll be it then. So make sure to uh, leave a wee comment down below. And uh, aye, apologies for going AWOL for four or five months. It will not happen again. And um, pretty much that's it, man. Till next time, being sort of Scotland 90. It's been about five years since I did this. But peace.